and welcome to How to Cook Great Food. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family? Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. On the main today, and as you can see, just this second finished, we're going to make a mushroom curry, but a dry Indian type of vegetable dish. I really love this one with some roti or naan or some sort of bread. Really easy, really healthy, vegan, tasty. Let's go and do it. Okay, let's take a look at some of the ingredients we'll be using for this one. In the centre, the star of the show, I've got some mushrooms. They're just a fresh, regular white mushroom. You could use a different type if you wanted. Over here I've got some sliced onion, that's just like one medium sliced onion. Here a very small tomato, we just need to add a little bit of tomato to this one, which I like to do. Just chopped, you know, fairly small. Fresh green chilli, cilantro or fresh coriander. Here I've got garlic ginger paste, 50-50 mix of garlic and ginger. That's about a heaped, a nice really heaped teaspoon. Some oil to start us off, I'm going to be using a sunflower oil. Again, you could use what you wanted. Only using two powders today, and they're about equal parts, like a small teaspoon of chili powder and turmeric. To this side, we've got our whole garam masala, or our whole seeds. So for this one, again, you could change this if you wanted. I'm using cumin seeds, black mustard seeds, and a couple of little dried chilies. Really simple, really fast, this one. Let's get over to the cooker. Okay, so we've got our pan here. I'm using just like a little wok. My favorite little pan at the moment. You can do this in a frying pan or anything, quite frankly. That oil's in and just heating up. We're gonna start off by putting in our whole garam masala. So in that goes, and like I say, that's black mustard seeds, cumin seeds, and a little bit of dried red chili. We just wanna infuse that little bit of oil. They'll start to crack and pop. And as that happens, we're going to add our onions and our garlic ginger paste. But really simply, we're on quite a high heat as you may hear. We're just going to stir fry this around for two minutes. At this stage, we're now going to add in our mushrooms. When I've sliced these, you can cut them any way you wish. And again, two minutes, let's stir fry them on this high heat. So as you can see here, they've just started to reduce down. They're gonna give off a little bit of moisture. I mean, depending on the type of mushrooms you're using. I'm now going to add a little bit of salt to taste. A little bit of chopped tomato. My fresh green chilli. And my two powders, which are chilli powder and turmeric. And again, another two minutes, high heat, frying all the time and stirring. Okay, off goes the heat, in goes our fresh cilantro or coriander, one last stir. And that's done, that's a really simple, tasty if you ask me, healthy vegan dry mushroom masala. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and we'll see you soon. Lots of love. With thousands of recipes and millions of views, why not subscribe to our channel and join the family?